All right, so we are back with a podcast that is not about oh, an episode. Why Lord. are you yawning? Did you just what? wake up? <laughs> what do you think, pal? Uh, Lord, I did. This had better be some crucial information for JP to get up before 2 p.m. From what I have read, this is a pretty interesting theory. Oh, boy. All right, so forewarning, there are going to be comic spoilers Comic ahead. spoilers? Comic spoilers uh, and show predictions. So <clears throat> this is actually a pretty cool theory. Lay it right, on me. Now folks are starting to think, that, uh, you know, a, a theory a while back had been that Sasha was going to take Holly's place in the comics as the person that Negan killed and was returned with a bag over her head mm-hmm. um, and ultimately bit Denise, which Denise is now dead, so that's not yeah. going to happen. Um, but now Heath has been apparently abducted by what we can assume to be the saviors. There's an oh, interesting yeah. theory that Heath's fate will be, and again, if you don't want comic spoilers, then tune away now. But his he will get Holly's fate, which is Negan will kill him, put a bag over his head, which we've actually had this done already by Fear the Walking Dead. Right. But put a bag over his head and then send him over to Rick and them, only for them to pull the bag. Because the actor's got a main role in another uh, show. I think it's 24. Yeah, I, I so, read somebody left that in our comments. So I'm sure he'll be trying to make his exit soon. Which 24, I don't know if that's just going to be like a mini series or what, but it's the second time they've brought it back since it officially like ended. So yeah. that's cool. So apparently there's a possibility that uh, he will be the one to get now, killed. Now, does that also mean that one of Negan's men is going to try to rape Heath <laughs> like he tried to rape Ollie? For those that uh, that don't read the comics uh, but do watch the show in the comics, what happened is we learned that Negan is very against sexual yes. assault and rape because he walks into a room to catch one of his henchmen trying to, trying to rape this girl named Holly, who was actually the girl that Abraham had left Rosita for yeah um, but so he's trying to rape her and Negan comes in and gives him this whole you know we don't rape blah 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 and he's like so we'll never do that again will we and the guy's like no we won't and Negan just shoves a knife through his throat and is yeah. like nope we won't and then tells Holly you know we're sorry we're not yeah, we're not, we're not rapists yeah and then the next time we see Holly she's got a bag over her head and she's being returned to the Alexandrians but she's a zombie and they don't know it yeah so when uh, Denise pulls the bag off off her head. She gets bitten by Holly. Mm-hmm. So, but you know, the thing that does suck about this, if you watch Fear the Walking Dead, that is a really cool tactic. Like in the it comic, is. it was really cool. It was very creative. Uh, and in the show, it would have been. But you wasted it on Fear the Walking Dead. Yeah, they Dead. totally did. I mean, that would have been a major. You know, I was watching a list, I think it was watchmojo.com today, of like the top 10 most shocking Walking Dead moments. That right there could have ended up on the list mm-hmm. as a shocking moment. Like you don't see it coming, but. But, you know, it's been done before. Yeah, I'm surprised they let him get away with that, too, because that's a pretty crucial moment, you know, mm-hmm. in the Kumik book. In the Kumik book. Yeah. So it could be Heath. Now, I saw another video that was talking about the possibility of there being some kid following Heath, but I really I got sidetracked and didn't get to finish it. A little kid following him? They say that you could see a kid very briefly in it. I'm going to have to watch it a little closer. but Huh, like a kid sidekick. Yeah. That's cool. Heath and... And what's a good sidekick name if your name is Heath? Kid Heath, I don't know. Heath and little yeah. So uh, you know, there's a possibility that we may see Heath make an exit soon, and it'll be terrible because he maybe he'll go back and see Daryl. You know, maybe yeah. that'll be some good drama. He'll be taken back, kept prisoner for a while. Um, man, wouldn't it be cool if it was Daryl that they did that to? Just because you would really oh, not no, expect that. No, I don't that. even want to think about that. But that's wild. So right now we possibly have Heath heading towards Negan. We know we've got Carl and Jesus heading mm-hmm. towards Negan. Daryl's already there. So it's about to be a party at Negan's yeah, house. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> what I uh, what I've read too, Jeffrey Dean Morgan has said that he will be pro- promised that he will be heavy in the next two episodes. Uh-huh. That he will be. No more Mr. Nice Guy. Yeah, like he's going to be, and he's going to be all, you know, very, the episodes are going to very much be around him and not mm-hmm. so much, you know, around side characters. Because they say the Walking Dead's ratings have been dropping, but even I can still, imagine. for the Walking Dead, I think Tara's episode, and I might be wrong on the number here, there's somebody like 11 million or something. So it's like, oh, eh, that's not, that, even if that's a low number, that's yeah. still outdoing that's a still lot a of other shows. Of, especially on cable, you know? Yeah. I mean, it's the number one show on cable for yeah. a good reason. But so I do hope that um, that Negan is present. But that is a cool little theory that we may be seeing. And I, I don't know when we would see that. I honestly, I've read things where people think it might happen at, at the series finale. I can see that being the mid-series finale. Yeah, absolutely. I, I, he's not a big enough character, I feel like, 
to to drag that out that long. You know what I mean? So basically, in the next episode, the final scene is probably going to be Heath is you know getting raped. Negan walks in, <laughs> kills his own man, and then it's like Heath, we're we're I can't do a Negan impression, but he's just going to tell him we're not monsters and basically strangle him. Hey, I was going to say, and no one really knows how Holly was killed. We can assume strangula- strangulation, perhaps. Maybe yeah. she was stabbed, but there's no blood on yeah, her clothes. Yeah, no blood. I, which I, I'd be like, just stab me. I don't want to be strangled to death. I don't know which would be worse. But I guess yeah, right. if you hit like a major artery, you'd bleed out really quick. But. Yeah, and it would just you know, it would just go to sleep. But just strang- oh. I mean, losing, not being able to breathe freaks me yeah, out. That's yeah. one of my biggest fears is to die by not being able to breathe. Same here. Oxygen is pretty, pretty, pretty good. <laughs> It's good stuff. Death by asphyxiation. Oh, Lord have Ugh. mercy. But so, yeah, there's an interesting little theory. We thought we'd, we'd sh- actually, JP, we were actually getting ready to go to the gym. JP, I just mm-hmm. kind of dragged onto the podcast. I was like, I got a cool theory for you. I'll tell you on the mic. So JP hadn't heard this theory. Yeah, and I couldn't wait to hear it. And Pretty interesting, yeah. though, when you think about it. I mean, it could be Heath, hopefully not attempted rape, but it could be Heath uh, with a bag over his head. Uh, they think they're getting him returned, but when they pull the bag off, now mm-hmm. the question here's a good question. Ooh. Here's a good question before we go. Who would he bite? Because in the comics, it was because Heath and Denise were actually together. She wasn't a lesbian in the comics. And so wow. the, the doctor, uh, well, Denise pulls the, the bag off Holly's head and she bites Denise, and Denise dies. And mm-hmm. I think Michonne puts her out of her misery or something. But so, something like that. So. It was Heath's girlfriend that got bit, but now it might be Heath that is that has the bag over his head. So that begs the question because his glasses are broken, and that this just may may be me. But mm-hmm. obviously, he needs his glasses. I would think. so. I'm thinking the sign of the broken glasses, or the broken glasses, could be a sign that he's going to die because he's, gonna he's never going to be able hearts. to to wear them again. So he, you know, I don't think they'll have him walking around the zombie apocalypse half blind. No. Um, with so much emphasis on, you know, obviously needing the glasses. So I mean to me that just that the broken glasses are a sign that he's going to die very very soon. Um but maybe in that way they'll return him with a bag over his head when they pull it off, but that's the question. Who would yeah. he bite? Gosh, I don't know. It, you would think it would be Rick that would be the one to walk up and pull the yeah pull the bag off the head. And I've seen some things where even people think Rosita will be the one that that is returned with a bag over her uh-huh. head because she. And that is an interesting way to look at it because Rosita obviously is going to take out a, a is a, is planning to take vengeance on Negan all on her own yeah. without the with or without the group's help. So it could be she attempts to assassinate him. He gets her that she's captured. And then we have that. Whole Anything thing. could happen. But it's still interesting to think the show could switch it up and, and put a bag over Heath's head yeah. and have him as the zombie. But that's the who would he bite? It better not be Spencer because, again, comic book spoilers yeah. here. You know, if you are reading the comics, please tune away. Or if you don't want to know the fate of Spencer in the comics as a result of the show, then don't listen. But so in the comic, Negan, and I won't say how because it's a very, very. It's very, interesting yeah. way how he kills him. Um, but he kills Spencer kind of suddenly. Um, and if they wasted Spencer's death with a bite from uh, Heath, I awful. would be furious because that is a, a that is a pivotal mo- you know moment, just yeah. like Glenn getting his head beat in. So they better keep thing. Spencer's. But so I'm going to make a prediction that, okay, uh, if Heath is a zombie, number one, we got to ask ourselves who, because the doctor, Denise and Holly, I think were good friends. Mm-hmm. That's why the Denise, you know, the doctor rushed to help her. And even if they weren't, she's a doctor, I guess. Yeah. Like, but so we got to ask ourselves who's close with Heath? Who, who of the Alexandrians is best friends with Heath that would rush forward if he were brought after they thought uh-huh. it was? It could be Tara. Could, I was going to uh, yeah, Tara. Tara is back now, and when they bring Heath back, I didn't even think about that because Tara was the one with him. You know, mm-hmm. she's become you know kind of tight with Heath, and so yeah, actually, you know what? That's going to be my prediction. Is going to be that, that they pull sense. the bag off of his head. He uh, Heath has been turned into a zombie, and it'll be Tara that rushes forward. You know, mm-hmm. oh my God, I'm so glad you're okay. Pulls the bag off, and he's going to bite Tara. So Heath and Tara both gone before the season's over with. That's my prediction. I, I could uh, I could see that happening. The only other person I really know that uh, I can remember him having rapport with was uh, Michonne. But I, I mean, they're not going to you know do that to her if they kill my Michonne. Yeah, I just don't think I can do this. Anymore. Yeah, 
So. Actually, I just saw a preview of the new Tupac movie with uh, the Nigga she playing looks great. Tupac's yeah. mom. It's... And uh, what's her name? Maggie's in that as well. Is she really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't I can't know. Can't remember that. the actress's Laura, name. Laura Cohen, Cohen is yeah. in the Tupac movie. She sure is. Oh, that's awesome. I can't remember who she uh, plays, but I she's in there. I wanted to see it to begin with, but now I really want to see yeah, it. Yeah, I know. It looks really that's nice. That's awesome. So, yeah. uh, some cool things. So, that's my prediction uh, is Heath will be killed. He'll hold a bag over his head. That mm-hmm. might be the mid season finale. Like, I could that's totally how see the mid season and wraps up leaving you like holy crap because um, they just took two major characters out in the beginning so mm-hmm. I don't think we're going to see a major character die mid-season finale I would hope not maybe season finale but not mid-season well, finale you never know but you don't so awesome so thank you for stopping by and hanging out with us on this little short podcast yep. uh, we will see you again Monday uh, it, it perhaps our prediction will come to light sooner than we think we'll see and uh knows? old silly matt doss will be back finally back from the beach i'm gonna start calling him that silly matt doss that's silly matt trade doss. market trade yeah. market so that's for now on that's what his name is right silly matt doss. silly matt doss okay well i <laughs> might have a t-shirt made <laughs> that hey there you yeah. go merchandise if we get t-shirts made comment below if you would uh want one because we are definitely thinking about doing some merchandise and we need to know who yeah. to send it to yeah So once again, I am Justin. And I'm JP. And we'll see you next time.